So what do we have to look forward to this week? Well, for starters, this is the Bitcoin fear and greed index in the deep fear zone. We haven't been at this level of panic in the crypto markets since Bitcoin was 30K. And that was obviously an incredible buying opportunity. So what could be a major catalyst for volatility in the price of Bitcoin and crypto? Well, this week we have stock markets fragile bounce at stake as Powell, the Federal Reserve Chairman, prepares the Jackson Hole speech. Market watchers widely expect Federal Reserve Chair Jer Jerome Powell to set the tone for a September interest rate cut. What has the real estate market, the crypto market, the early stage bioscience market, every early stage revolutionary technology that requires a low cost of capital. What have they all been waiting for? Rate cuts, right? So they're setting the tone this week at a symposium on Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern time. So if he says anything to the effect of let's cut interest rates significantly in September, markets are going to absolutely rally. If he says anything to the contrary, markets are going to crash, right? So we'll see. Maybe they want a crash because every time we get a crash, they have a good excuse to pump in liquidity and do that emergency rate cut that always rallies markets. But in the meantime, money is just flooding into Bitcoin from some of the biggest buyers on the planet. Bitcoin spot ETF cumulative flow almost at $20 billion dollars the most successful launch of any asset in history right so obviously we're just getting started with that asset and these other assets like these altcoins like chainlink right the chainlink adoption update for the week of august 12th to august 18th these are all assets that are using chainlink's revolutionary blockchain infrastructure